Uh, my name is Aisha Karanja. I am a member of an organization called Back to Basics, which is a women-led organization that is effecting positive change through basics. How was the event of today in terms of obje objectives? I think it was great. I think uh, it was very, very insightful, very engaging. Beyond our expectations, we are really, really excited. Yeah, effect positive change. We need all the stakeholders on board. So what are you going to do to make sure that all the others who are not yet part of the conversation become part of the conversation? Uh, for us, we take today as a beginning. And uh, it's a beginning, so we just uh, called a few stakeholders, tried to, as much as possible, represent as many uh, players as possible. But going forward, I think we need to expand the, the forum, we need to expand the conversation, and for the conversation to go beyond, then we really have to put more players on board. And yes, we are going to do that. And we have had a lot of conversations with Kenya Bureau of Standards, with CJAD, with uh, youth representation, with the church, with schools, and everybody has given us their insights. And we are now going to sit down and look at the recommendations that people give. And then we see, we at least we have a beginning point of how to move this conversation to the next level. If you had to give one request to the government, what would it be in regards to, you know, eliminating poison, this lead poison, and create awareness and enforce the ban? Yeah. Thank you so much, Aisha, for giving us this interview. Thank you. Thank you very much, and thank you for coming. Mm -hmm. We do appreciate your presence, mm -hmm. and especially the role that you play mm -hmm. to ensure that we trickle down this info information to the lowest bottom. Thank you.